It is the lowest of the low. Tonight, Cleveland police are looking for thieves who robbed a local church. Someone broke in and made off with the sound system, the wine for communion, cash boxes, and emptied the food pantry. Dave Arnold has the story live on 5. Security is a little tighter here at a bilingual Roman Catholic church, even for questions about a baptism. Inside the, the church here, they took the amplification system for the choir. Pastor Robert Reedy explains why he got an early morning call from a custodian saying that thieves had helped themselves to the church the night before. The church is called La Sagrada Familia, which means the Holy Family. They took a couple of bottles of wine out of the sacristy that we use for the religious services. There were seven of the choir microphones were taken. There was a whole son council there and mixer that was, that was taken. A chalice of mine was, was taken. One of the things was the, uh, the food. We give out food once a month here, and it was the night after the food was prepared. And the next day, people were coming to get their monthly uh, donation. 24 dozen eggs were stolen, and we're not sure how many bags, but these were food that was to be given to the people the next day. That's pitiful, really, because there's no need to be stealing in the church. If they be giving you food and the money's for the poor, why would you even try to break into the church? To make matters even worse, Pastor Reedy said there were no signs of forced entry. He said police think one person or more may have attended an evening mass, hiding out inside to pull the theft off. There may be things that were taken that we still don't, haven't found out. That's a terrible thing to do. You know, I mean, the church trusts the community, and now what are you going to do? It's hard to believe that people would come into a church and, you know, not only disrespect God, but also disrespect the community that's dedicated to help them. Live on 5 in Cleveland, I'm Dave Arnold. In all, a $6,000 loss. The thieves stole the poor boxes as well. Money destined for poor children here and in Peru. Right now, the church is trying to replace its sound system's microphones. If you were a witness to the church robber's getaway, someone with a shopping cart stuffed full walking along Detroit Avenue late at night, Cleveland police ask that you contact their detectives at the 2nd District Command Office.